Hey guys, before the video begins, I would like to make a very important announcement in regards to a new channel made by a friend of mine, Kelly Productions. He has created a new channel named The Watch. It's a channel dedicated to making superhero films and miniseries of a new universe that has been created and named The Watch. And the first film is out right now. If you follow me on Twitter, Instagram, or even on this very channel, you know I've spoken about a film that's been involved that I've been involved with. Well, this is it. The Midnight Warden. I'd highly appreciate it if you guys subscribed to this channel, liked the video, turned on notifications, and shared this film with your friends so we can make more films in the future. The more awareness of our films, the more we can make. You can find a link to the channel in the description below this video, or click on my channel and go to the section channels, and it will be there as we speak. And with that being said, guys, I hope you enjoy today's video. What's going on, everybody? My name is Elfrin, and welcome back to yet another reaction. Now, today I got a different TF2 series that I haven't reacted to on the channel before. This is the Scratch Universe Episode Six, Part One. And before you say anything, thing along the lines of why didn't you react to the other ep other episodes? I've said this before in some of my TF2 reaction videos. I've already completely caught up with the series. And by the time those some certain videos came out, my microphone was not working. So, where you guys ask, that's the reason. So, that being said, we've got the Scratch Universe Episode 6, Part 1. And I just read his comment section, explaining why this is two different parts. So, all caught up. I remember all the videos based on the Scratch Universe. The stands, the Scouts, the Soldier, the Heavy. Little robots that come from another dimension, the medic. I know it all. <laughs> so, with that being said, guys, we are going to click play on this bad boy since this literally came out the day I'm recording this. <laughs> video literally came out a few hours when uh, this video was made. So, now, guys, now YouTube schedules go. But with that being said, guys, hopefully you guys will enjoy my reaction to this. Started in three, one. I'll see if I need subtitles on. I think Black and Miss presents. Go, go, go! Crash move them out! Gotta move that gear up! Move them out! They got water next to me. Like always. Go back to Canada, you Canadian. <laughs> Man, I don't know about you, but I want to see what's in store. You know? We got freaking keys, man. Yeah. If our pay is always gonna be keys, why not spend a bit around? Improve the look? Get some casual wares? Maybe fetch something for the house? Yeah. I remember what Janitor said about spending. It's just an idea. So you guys enjoying the new joint? It's a tough game. <laughs> Bonk bot. We're doing server maintenance by cleaning the maps up for the next fragging matches. It's quite a slog, but oddly relaxing. We also met some awesome people in there, including a robot. Now you got my attention. Her name's Molly. She's a custom-built sentry drone. Helps us clean the place up by spotting tools we need, and teleports the waste to disposal. Sweet. I gotta meet those guys one day. Especially Molly. It'd be nice to know another bot like me. I hope so too, bud. You guys going already? We're gonna see some stores. You wanna join us for a bit, before we head to work? Oh, absolutely. <laughs> Why is he on the- Did you just freaking jump from the rooftop? Yeah, I saw it on TV. Wanted to give it a try. I say it was pretty good. <laughs> you want to be a superhero. <laughs> Been thinking about that lately. Isn't that what I am? I have no idea, bud. You do what you think is right, but don't make a big deal out of yourself. We're just three scouts in an apartment making a living. We don't need that kind of attention. The VSC was enough. Gotcha! <laughs> Where are we headed? Just gonna grab some coffee. You drink coffee? Yeah. I've been needing it a lot more lately. What about you, Jumpy? You're gonna He's drink on board too? with it too. Nice man. Red Bar Calf Light. What a name. I won't lie, lad. That was a tough one. But fine. 
busy place. It's early hours, man. People need their coffee. Oh, Good another morning. robot. <laughs> An espresso for me, please. Looks like Bob. Make that too. Yes. Hold on, guys. One second. Sorry. Okay, sorry about that, guys. Go back and I, re I re went back a couple of seconds. Make that too. Yes. He literally straight up looks like Bob. You didn't tell me the bot down here was a bot. <laughs> Wanted it to be a surprise. It's fine. He's with us. Thanks, Pally. What was that all about? He's cautious around other bots. Thought you Why? were with Gray. Why is that a problem? He's a defect. Gray Man doesn't like having defects in his army. Leaves him with a bad impression. That's awful. Yeah. Yeah. Fortunately, they're smuggled out of there. Good. I'm glad. <laughs> John Suit always Dude, does that. That's steaming hot coffee. No, it doesn't matter Man. if bother him. You got some grit. <laughs> Bunch of heavies hanging out. Does that outfit look familiar on that pyro? I feel like I've seen it somewhere else. The Genesee is quiet. Jesus, man, you just butchered that pronunciation. In my defense, I've never been good with French. This place must be new. Want to head inside? Yeah. <laughs> Pretty decent. Why is there... You know what? I haven't played TF2 in a long time. Welcome. Hey! Where can I browse your wares? It's to your right. Thanks. Where did Bonkbot go? There's stock available for Scout. Have a look. What's Bonk Bot thinking? It seems so familiar. It's like I've been there before. Do you require assistance? No need, thanks. Just tag it along with those two. Of course. What is he doing? Yeah! You see that? What are you casual. Is it good? Hey, Bonkbot. You seeing this? What do you think? Oh, I get it. It's just a mannequin for them it's to put clothes on. Walk. Sweet. Done. What does he want? Now it's perfect. Attire for each occasion. But then what will we call him? Jagged? <laughs> <laughs> He's like he liked it. <laughs> I'll request a group together. I'll be paying. Your total is 35 refined, or $127. What is your payment method? Wow. <laughs> Bell, I... Fixer. We both owe you one. We both live in your house. So, we both want to make it up to you. Keys are very valuable in the game. The items have been added to your profiles. Thank you. 
before you go. On the house. Use them as you please. Or convert them to currency if you wish. You can take them. I'm good. Have a good day, gentlemen. Thanks. You too. That was unexpected. You guys aren't gonna try any stuff on? We have to get going to work. Save it for the next occasion. Fair enough. Let's get going now. I guess Bonkbot's going back to the house because he can't go to work with them. Oh, we don't watch more scout baseball. Okay, we're leaving off right where we left the soldier and the heavy. Got uh, Kia, I think his name was. And then, um, uh, what the heavy was calling himself? I forgot. He <laughs> got the pyro from the T, from the. Thumbnail. Another attack. Empire. What happened? We stopped. This isn't our destination. No, seriously. What the hell's going on? Nothing to worry about, I hope. The power malfunctioned in the deeper facilities. How long is this going to take? At ease, partner. We think it's just a small outage, or a broken fuse. It's a small inconvenience. The train will continue on after the gates have been powered up again. Surely you have backup plans, right? That's what I'm trying to find out. But communication's down. Why can't you just go there and check it out? We all have somewhere to be. I got a tour of duty to do so I can get my goddamn wage. Ma'am, I understand your frustration. <laughs> we all want this to come back to normal as well. But there's nothing I can do. I'm the only one in charge of this place, and I can't leave it unsupervised. Those are the rules. <sighs> Unbelievable. You're VAC security, and you're completely alone in this place. That's correct. We never get stops here. This is just a checkpoint. There's no need to assign more people here. Mm. All right. Is this everyone in the train? Nobody else? Okay, seems like everyone's here. Total of six people. Everyone, let's step away from the train, please. Have a seat on the benches and pass some time. What the... I don't wait, trust wait, these guys. Those guys don't look like security. Who the hell are they? Just people waiting for a train. Please walk away from the train. If we all cooperate, we'll all get back to our lives in no time. Whatever, dude. This will all be over soon, fellas. Hmm. I'm thinking it's another distorted attack waiting to happen. The uh, robot guys. Something about what he said doesn't add up. I am guessing it is related to those people. Not what I had in mind. But he did contradict himself regarding checkpoints. Trains don't stop at checkpoints to pick up passengers. What is it that you noticed? The AC security never leaves a server in the hands of a single guard. It's always a group of at least three. Something's off. Do you think they are distorted? It's possible. Don't take your chances yet. I have a plan. Or the mail. We can convince him to let us in the server backbone. That's where the problem is. What if he was lying? He wasn't. You can't shut off the power of a server from any location other than the backbone. It's the law. Now keep in mind, if we don't play along, we'll be stuck here. So, here's the plan. First, we'll try to convince him to let us in the backbone. Second, we'll get inside and bring power back. With or without the use of force. 
I know my way around a server backbone, so we won't be lost. And lastly, activate he is a former VAC soldier. And head on to our destination. Kira, the more we speak about this, the more it seems like a trap. What if this is all a trap? We'll have to spring it. We have no other choice. If it ends up being the case, we'll adapt the plan as we go along. Follow my lead. Yeah. It's the soldier and heavy from the train. We want to ask some questions. Sure thing, fellas. Come on in. Do you know the source of the outage? I wish I did. Blasted station just lost power entirely. Communications went down along with it. I'm sure that can easily be fixed if you just go to the place to check. What exactly do you think we can do here? Nothing harmful. Hopefully. But them's the rules. I can't leave my post without hearing from command. What if we do it for you? You can just guide us on your radio the way through. Listen up. You are civilians. You are gonna stay here and wait until I hear from command. Mm. Now please step outside and have problems in the server backbone, isn't it? <laughs> Don't <him. laughs> Come again. What did you just say? You mentioned a power outage. If servers have one of those, you can restore power by hitting into the backbone. The same applies for communications between the backbone and this station. You can't leave your station, and that's understandable. You can just let me and my colleague inside, and we'll take care of the issue. Vulture of Fortune. Well, isn't this just my lucky day then? You could have just shown that from the start. So, you're both here, I see. He's my intern. I'm showing him the roots. Duh. All right then. <laughs> Give me a few to grab the tools to let you guys in. We're set. Be on alert once we get inside. You did that quite well. Is that actually your badge? Yeah. I use it for situations like this. <laughs> Clever. Hey, you too. You're going to fix the problem, right? I heard a bit of the conversation. Look, I want to get out of here just as much as you do. Something's definitely wrong here. I can feel it. But I really don't want to stick around. I'd rather take my chances on wherever you're going. Are you sure? You two look like you know what you're doing. I don't think an extra dude on your team is going to be detrimental. I know my way around tough situations. <laughs> so what's your guys' plan? How did you convince him? We are going to fix the power outage for him. Okay, but how did you convince him? I know you two are definitely not from around here. I saw you getting on a train. We have experience in situations like these. Yeah, they do. It's a problem we can fix. Okay, fair enough. If you guys are fixing things, I can certainly help out. I know a thing or two as well. Is it okay for you if you... If you... Uh, yeah, it's a little confusing. Forgive me if I am intruding. You look feminine, but speak strangely. How should we call you? Listen, I only have a simple rule. You can call me a he, she, they, whatever. I don't care. Just don't call me an it. I'm not a goddamn dog. Okay? <laughs> not unclear. <laughs> so can I join you guys for this little job thing? I'm not gonna sit around and wait for hours. I'll go insane. It is fine by me. Here. You can relax. I know how to take care of myself. I won't get in your way. Halo music. I know I may seem like trouble, 
Most of us scouts make more problems than we solve them. But you have oh, it's a scout from the very first episode. I, way. I promise you. I want to live my life knowing I did something good. It's my way to return the favor after all the fun times I had on this server. Here. Here. Is it okay for you if they join us for this? Sure. Thanks. Much appreciated. Hey, boys! Gotta be the scout from the very first episode. Why do you want my reply? You're the one calling the shots. Everyone on the team deserves to be heard, Kier. I make sure to give everyone a chance for that. Yeah, you're right about that, big man. Well said. If we are to be together for this, what do we call you? Call me Smoke. Smoke. Same life, different look, always smoking. <laughs> Very well, Smoke. And you two? I know he's Kia, but what about you, big guy? I am heavy guy. Heavy That's guy, that was it. You don't have any weapons? <laughs> I guess not. Nah, it's fine. I won't judge. I appreciate you doing this, partners. She's with me. An intern just like the heavy. She mentioned going to a tour of duty. Yes. Our shift was finished and we were heading into a tour of duty to blow off some steam. You know how it is. The job's tough. And the wage. Unfortunately, internship isn't paid. And I still hate that fact, sir. Smoke, come on. Watch your words. You got quite the intern soldier. It's difficult to get people to join us. Can't really say that's the case here, partner. We can stay in touch. Shouldn't be a problem. All you need to do is go inside the server backbone. Tell them I sent you and they should guide you to where you need to go. Any questions? No. <laughs> the stand <laughs> to see the password. Remember, go inside, find someone from the security crew, and follow their guidance. Call me if you run into any problems. Good luck. Gotta be a distorted. Yep. Uh oh. <laughs> Not yeah. He's one of the distorted. <laughs> uh oh. Again, the harvesting? Uh oh. Dispose of them, not infect them? What just happened? Oh no, it's a pyro. He took off the mask. <laughs> what is underneath? I don't like that. <laughs> I thought the eyes were the worst thing. Third episode. Why does it have a sucker? I want. They want to destroy the heavy and soldier to still interfere with their plans. Nice hunting we did back there. Engineer, where do we go from here? 
Do you read? Engineer, come in! Now, point. Signal is scrambled. So we're fixing the communications? No. We're trapped in here. What? The backbone keypad lost power. They shut it down. So you're saying we're stuck here? Why? Kier, do you think? Yeah. The engineer was a distorted. Weren't they easy to notice? Recently infected ones. Yes. Once they've been infected for a while. The server that they took over for a while. If they survive long enough, the stronger and more intelligent they get. The engineer was at least at the first stage. What the hell are you talking about? The entire server is compromised with distortion. If you see a mercenary with a weird face, that's a distorted. Kill them on sight. Distortion? What is that? Is this a virus or something? Yes. yes. It is an alien virus. Wait, so is that what I heard about an outbreak on Railway United? Yeah. Shit. Can we even leave this place? Server backbones have emergency power. They're usually inside small rooms. Are you VAC? Not anymore. Let's move out. The more we stay here, the worse it'll become. Yeah. The distorted do not fuck around. <laughs> yep. Do you smell that? Hold on. Let us continue. Jeez, where am I already almost done? Do you smell that? Okay. <laughs> What is that smell? Death and decay. Oh, I'm gonna throw up. You'll get used to it. God, I hope you're right, dude. Doesn't this smell get to you heavy? The smell does not, but I feel tension. Your survival instincts are kicking in. But why? We're in a derelict. A derelict? Oh. Backbone is also compromised. Everyone be on high alert. They already know we're here. Yep. Camera system. Recorded. We have to move. Can you defend yourself? I already told you I can. You have bow. Isn't that sniper weapon? I know, but this is where I want it to be. Oh, damn! Oh, that was quick! You need to watch your back, dude. At ease. Already knew it was there. So you were testing me? You have a fast draw that can dispose of light glasses with a single shot. That's good. Is he always like this? This is new to me. Smoke, just a heads up. <laughs> yeah, this is you new. see weird things happening around me and heavy. Ignore it. Define weird things. Don't worry about it. Knowing you've got good skill with your bow, we can take a stealthy approach and pick them off. Both of you, follow behind me, watch for my signals, and keep it quiet. Smoke, Go you'll on. be my dispatch. Heavy, you'll be making sure nothing gets behind us. You're free to use him. Let's move. I was thinking that the pyro would have a stand. When I saw the teaser. Ordered, yep. Headshot. Another one. Good with the bow. How many bows does he have left, though? Two left. Three. Second arrow. It's just so it, yeah. out of ammo.
automatic. Rushes its victims, then it blows up. Don't let it blow up near you. Let's back it up. That noise will draw them out. Get behind some cover. You're ready. Getting new, newer variations. Is that Pyro? I remember that mess. A screamer. Wait, you guys have you you have one of those two? So the pyro does have one. One of what? Money. <laughs> I was right. Uh oh, teleporter. Going up. The floating soldier with all the gear. I saw that. Wait, so. You saw that? Yeah. You saw his stand. Is that what that is? <laughs> you can see this. Yes, I have my own too. You can come on, Switch. We're not alone anymore. Switch. Ooh. You need a long range archer. Power E to A. Potential A. Speed C. Range A. Durability A. Precision B. This is Switch Wu. My helper ghost. Ha <laughs> ha! Smoke your stand user! Very good! You're throwing a lot of new information at me, guys. That's your stand. And you're its user. A stand user. Incoming. No time to explain you the basics. Prepare yourselves. I had a feeling that Smoke would be a stand user. Just based on the teaser. Now stop nodding your Damn. <laughs> Zombie pyros. <laughs> Soldier remembers them. It's been a while. For the very first episode. As disposable as ever. These pirates, they do not look like the one we saw before. These are sniffers. Mine, but have an incredible sense of smell. They can smell your emotions. That's a screecher. It seems like the pyros have more different variations than other ones. And the other distorted. Pyro, not the pyros, the spies get their own variations with knives. Fingers. Oh. <laughs> Straight up fighting, hand on hand combat with one. Ooh. Suplex. <laughs> it's not. Oh, not dead yet. There we go. It's dead now. Sentry forward. Oh. oh. They got the sentry. Dapper. Uh oh, heavy. We need to kill that engineer. We know. We're on it. Zap the entry sentry with an arrow. Nice. 
Nice. <laughs> Double arrow. <laughs> nice. God, I love Black Mrs. Animation. Was that an ability of your stand? Yeah, I can switch the properties of two objects around. So in this case, I took the sapper's type of damage and switched it with the type of damage from one of Switch's arrows. But it's temporary. It's mostly one time use for certain gadgets. I could also make a balloon heavier than a rock if I wanted to by switching her weight. This is a rundown version because her ability can get pretty technical. Hmm. Good stuff. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. Now they have to get out of the backbone. Let's move out. Guys, hold up. Hear me out for a minute here. We barely walked out of that first gate, and we've already faced all of this. Can you imagine what the hell is waiting for us? Beyond those rocks? Alright, that was a good... Switch has a good point. And smoke <sighs> has a good point. This is going to be a long day. Yeah, to be continued in part two. Whenever that will be. Alright! <laughs> This series just get, keeps getting more and more intense every time a video comes out. Oh my lord. Oh. Alright. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that reaction. I will continue to do more reactions to the Scratch verse in up and coming videos. So, that in mind, you guys. Um, whenever part two comes out, I will react to it as soon as possible. I got a few other things to, working on right now, so... I will give you guys more information about that in the future. But with that being said, guys, hopefully the action video. Please follow stuff, guys, and I'll see you next video. Bye.